The spinal cord stimulator helps reduce or eliminate pain. It's a small paddle or lead that lies on top of the spinal cord and provides a mild electrical pulse to the sensory pain fibers of the spinal cord and it interferes with the way that this is transmitted to the brain. I'm Heather Emberg. I have three boys, uh, age 10, 8, and 6. My life before the spinal cord stimulator, I was constantly on pain pills multiple times a day. The pain was constant. It got worse in the evening, so I was usually in bed by 4 or 5 o'clock. My life now, I can play with the kids, I can walk with the kids to the park. I can spend a whole day with them versus an hour. A spinal cord stimulator involves a couple pieces of hardware, one being a battery. Number two can either be a paddle lead or you can have individual leads. The wires then are slid underneath the skin and tunneled to the battery which was placed in the flank. These are connected together to allow current from the battery to be produced through the lead. The best thing about a stimulator is that you get a team of people to help you learn how to do this particularly the reps from the company. They will program the stimulator with multiple programs that you go home with the same day as surgery. And through the next day and weeks, they will help you learn how to use those programs to understand which one is going to help mitigate your pain the most. So I have several programs in here. Some that focus on my tailbone, some that focus on my whole lower back. Based on the activity, I turn it up or turn it down. So if I'm exercising, I usually turn it up. Before the pain ever started, I was a runner, and it's really hard to, to see people so active and not be able to walk to the kitchen. Patients can experience up to 100% in pain reduction. Oh, I'm, I'm not taking any pain medication right now. I don't have to go to bed that early. It's night and day.